YouTube. Let's get, get, get it. Back with another vid, YouTube. It's your boy, Big Gap. And today, in front of us, we have the Traxxas Fortec. Just about all of my parts came in. I'm waiting on my body to get painted. I'm waiting on my foam tires. That is it. Everything else came in ready to go. So we're gonna start it off. Got my Apex uh, metal gears right here. I got about four to choose from. I don't know which one I'm gonna go with yet, but I got four to choose from for my pinion gear. I have my metal spur gear. I have my hot racing motor mount. I have my steel dry shaft. I have my 6S ESC, and I have, last but not least, I have my 7700 KV motor. I will not be running this ESC. Get that to the side. So there it is, man, my 7700 KV motor. First time even looking at it. This thing is a baby. <laughs> Got that sensor wire, though, but that's crazy because I'm not going to be able to run sensor because this is not a sensor ESC. I don't think, no, it's not. It doesn't have, does it? Could I be wrong? Nope, I am right. This does not have a sense support for the ESC. This one does, but I'm not running that little baby. But look at this motor. <laughs> this thing is tiny, 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 whiny. Good grief. The motor shaft is really small. Magnets are pretty easy to turn. <laughs> so there it is 7700 kv we're gonna see what this guy can do fellas ladies and gentlemen so we're gonna get on into this video i'm not gonna do a build video i'm not gonna show exactly how i do all this i'm just gonna get it in and i'm gonna show you the afterwards the after product so with that being said we got the dry shaft we got the motor mount we got the spur gear we got the pinion gear we got the ESC and we got the motor. And with the tricks of the camera, we get everything in. One, two, three. Bada. Yes, sir. Everything is in. She looking good, looking good, looking great. Uh, I had to go with the Sidewinder 4 ESC. I didn't want to cut on my chassis just yet. I wanted to give this one a try. I wasn't able to put the 6S ESC in there. It was just a little too big. But I'm going to try this one out. And if it doesn't run the way I like it, I will be modifying, cutting that chassis to where I can get that uh, that bigger ESC in there. That's your 7700 KV motor. Got everything buttoned up. And also came in were the BSR phones. Got these the other day from the hobby shop. Um, Rattlecan has my body. He should have it painted by Tuesday. Today is Sunday. I think it's April 3rd or April 4th. April the 3rd, April the 4th, I'm sorry, Sunday, April the 4th. And so by Tuesday, he should have the uh, the body painted. It is a 69 uh, Camaro body. He should have it painted and ready to go. So that's my Fortec build, got it done. Hopefully, um, I ain't gonna tell y'all my gearing yet, but I'll let you know sooner or later, but Hopefully this setup is fast enough to do some good drag racing. I don't have to have the fastest car out there. I just want my car to go straight. And I know if I can go straight, I'll win some races. Uh, so there it is, my first Fortech build. I'm kind of liking it. I'm excited about getting it out. I needed to get my leads. I didn't solder leads on yet because I didn't get any. Uh, I only have Deans and I'm not gonna put Deans on there because most of my batteries are XT90s and EC5s. So there it is. Tracks is five tick. <laughs> All right, I appreciate y'all sticking around watching the video. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, dislike, whatever you like. YouTube, and I'm in it.